Today in our nation's capital, as the Trump administration is expected to announce the fate of more than two dozen national monuments. Two of those monuments are right here in Kern County. 23ABC's Faven K standing by live at Yokuts Park, where a rally was recently held with more. Good morning, Mike and Alex. That's right. The Sequoia National Forest right here in Kern County is one of those national monuments on the chopping block. Now, in total, there are 27 national monuments, but U.S. Secretary of Interior Ryan Zink has already pardoned six of them. And uh, several congressional Republicans have urged Trump and Zink to reverse monument designations made by Barack Obama and other presidents, calling them federal land grabs that restrict mining and energy development. Now, Trump campaigned on opening up more federal land to oil drilling and mining days before he was elected into office. But supporters say that these monuments help protect important landscapes and objects of history, including Native American antiquities. Now, a rally was held on Tuesday by the Sequoia Forest Keeper Organization here at Yokuts, Yokuts Park to convince the Trump administration to not remove the Sequoia National Monument. Now, legal experts say that while Trump has the authority to shrink the boundaries of these monuments, they're doubtful that he has the authority to get rid of them altogether. Now, the president's decision could set the a stage for a years-long battle, legal battle that could pit the White House against Indian tribes, environmentalists, and Western states. Now, again, U.S. Secretary, US Secretary of Interior Zinc will make those recommendations today. We'll continue to bring you the latest developments in this story on our website, turn to 23com Guys, that's the very latest here at Yokuts Park. I'm going to send it back to you in the studio.